Welcome back, everybody, to some more Nomoria, and yes, you're looking at a fresh screen. The reason you're looking at a fresh screen, quite simply, is that I tried to load the game. Something went wrong where it loaded, and I can't get back into it, so simple enough, we're going to start fresh. Anyway, I feel like I have learned a little bit more as I've read up on the, some wikis and some of your comments, so don't you worry about that. We're just going to get straight into it. So I did do a zoom out to take a lay of the land, and I think I want to start moving a little bit further north. Um, but the only problem with that is that this looks like a volcano, actually. Um, or at least inside there's some volcanic activity. Um, but this is the edge of the map, and I don't know necessarily if I want to move that far, um, as we are kind of in a, a nicer area right where we are. So we're going to do some uh, our, uh, uh, terrain management here by cutting um, some trees. So we're going to fell a little bit of the trees here, and uh, we're going to start maneuvering our gentle folk out into the open, the wild unknown, as some may say. So we're just going to hit play here, we're going to give the uh, good old auto save, and we're going to start immediately uh, by just getting some organization uh, placed. So, hitting play, people are going to start felling trees, and they're going to go buck wild and start swinging all over the place. We're also probably going to want to fell a few more in this general direction, just literally just start um, making a little bit of space here. Now it's going to take a little while, um, but that's probably going to be good enough right there. We're also going to do um, some stockpiling as well. But before we do that, we want to do some mining as well. So uh, we're going to swing into here, and we're going to start making a nice area um, into this giant mountainside uh, right about here-ish. We'll dig in, and we'll make this our sleeping area. So we're going to have our miners hopefully swinging down here. There they go. He's in he goes. And uh, from there, we'll probably make an area to sleep, which we're going to do from... Um, we can do one here, and one here, and then that's there, and actually I think this is off, it is off. Again, I'm not entirely used to how the blocks look. There we go. Um, let's do some more uh, mining, terrain, mine, walls, bam, and then we'll do... We'll just out a little bit, and the goal here is going to be to um, just make an area to sleep, essentially. Oh, there's some actual some rocks here. Interesting. Right there, that should give us a nice big room to sleep in. Um, actually, let's... I don't know if that's actually what I want, if it's there. So we're going to cancel that, and hopefully that'll be enough. We'll take a look here shortly, though. Once that's going down, we also should have a good chunk of trees going down very shortly. We're going to be making a stockpile room in here as well. We'll branch off and do that. I want to just get inside nice and quick. And let's just do uh, terrain, mine, a wall here. Just kind of get that mined out. Get in there. And as soon as that's mined out, there we go. We're also going to start mining out. Uh, we'll actually just do... We'll branch off to here. And we'll do a double, double wide area and then we'll just do something like this all be stockpile a nice long hallway of stockpiling and this in here we're gonna designate as our dormitory so we're gonna make sure we have that dormitory is gonna be in here and that should cover all of it that's good um, what we're gonna end up doing is making a bunch of straw beds because I did learn that's something we're gonna want to do and we'll have a workshop branch off as well um, just some basic, basic stuff. Let's take a look out here. How's everybody doing? They're still chopping trees, it looks like. So we're gonna get in, uh, moving in here. We'll do some more, uh, building, or terrain management, mine, walls. And we'll, we'll do this in here, and then we're gonna do something like that. It'll be as our workshop area. Perfect. And this is all gonna be storage, so we're gonna designate this area as stockpile. Bam, bam. The wham, bam. Thank you, man. Goods. It's going to be everything that we have. Uh, we just want soil, stone, and wood. We don't want anything else, even if they come across it, even if we craft it. Nothing else. Just the soil, stone, and wood. Bam. Done. So they're going to start moving. Everybody else should start hauling things in while our miners start mining. Um, hopefully, the only problem is going to be the logs, because the logs are uh, huge problems as far as how many there are. There's a lot, a lot, a lot of logs when they start doing that. Um, build a workshop, a crude workbench. We're going to want two or three, uh, I realize. So we're going to do 
Uh, we'll rotate. And we'll do one. Uh, we'll do... We'll do... Do a space. And then... Another one. We'll do three, because we're going to have them making separate tools all together. Um, but for now, that's going to be good, because they're going to be able to start slapping some stuff together here. Um, they're not going to be able to, I don't think, make it until we find some dirt. So, I mean, some stone. So we're also going to start digging out looking for some stone. Um, but we have a dormitory. We also want to build uh, furniture, straw beds. We're going to build as many. We can build eight. So one, only one person is not going to have a bed. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. So we're going to have eight straw beds. It's going to use all of our straw that we start with, um, but it'll allow these people to not sleep outside because they're freaking crazy for doing so. Oh, they actually are. You'll be able to use the dark rock. As you can see, it changes a little bit the way it looks. It's awesome. So that's good. I'm glad, actually, that that was able to happen. If they can get the straw beds up, look, these guys are... They got a lot of work to do. Um, we're going to start as well with the miners. We're going to have them work on mining a wall out this way just a little bit. We're basically turning this entire mountainside, from what I can tell, into something completely usable, which I'm really happy about. Um, and we're going to mine out eh, maybe just a little bit further. Um, and then we'll have a small area right about here, uh, of which I would like to start, start making a mining shaft. So. That's what that's going to be. It's going to be our beginning mining shaft. We have crude... Oh, good. We got crude workbench. Look at that. We've already caught up to where we were in the last episode, so I'm not even worried about it. Doing really, really well. Going to keep stockpiling. We might want to mine out a little bit more. Um, and do more designation as far as uh, what it's going to be used for. There we go. Just just to make a little bit further, uh, further area for stockpiles, so... That's going to be fine. We're going to make sure that happens. We're also going to make these guys uh, right here. Crude workbench. We're going to have planks. Uh, we want to craft... Uh, well, we actually get rid of that, actually. Um, craft to one. We're going to always want... I uh, think craft to two planks. Always have uh, up to two. Because I know how that this thing works now, which is great. We're always going to have a chair. And make sure we have craft up to one if we don't have any. And then the same thing with this one. Um, we're gonna have a workbench craft to to one to make sure we have it as many or as many as we can And I'm hoping they're gonna start using that now. So that's gonna be good uh, good stuff for us and uh, We're gonna designate more area as a stockpile Bam um, as we did last time as well soil stone and wood same as last time just to make sure there we go. Same with this straight area as well. Goods, soil, stone, and wood. Just the basics. It's just to be able to make sure that when we have the logs going, we have a good amount. We're also going to want to build outside a little bit shortly. Um, probably in this general area. Um, actually, where do I want to put them? Because this is... Where's the entrance to our home again? It's here. So let's um, potentially fell some more trees out here and clear this zone. Uh, let's do terrain... Nope, it's going to be agriculture, fell trees, and we're just going to kind of chop out the area of trees. Just a big zone right over here. Right up to there. And I'll get our wood choppers on that. But they have a dormitory now that they can sleep in, which is going to be awesome. And they still, oh man, our gnomes have so much work ahead of them. It's great. Look, they got planks now and everything. It's going to be awesome. Oh, look at this. Look at this. This is amazing. You guys are just really working hard, and I'm so happy about that. How's our food and wood? Uh, our food and drink. Our food and drink is actually still really good, so we have a, a time before we have to worry about um, building farms, but we're going to make sure we do get some farms going pretty shortly. You're actually there. One of them's thirsty. They're going to start doing some stuff. So here's where the logs are going to get it to become a pain in the ass, because we're going to have so many of them. It's probably going to fill up the rest. Well, that's fine. I'm not worried about that quite yet. Um, I, I'm more worried about getting our basic stuff set up, so... Uh, I'm hoping we can, uh, they start making chairs and stuff shortly. So, here we go. We're gonna, uh, see, do, okay, they're chopping trees still. As soon as this is cleared, we're gonna start making a pasture for our yaks who are somewhere out there. Actually, this log is probably a little too many logs, but whatever. I'm not worried about it. How much stone do we actually have? We have a lot of raw basalt pile. Well, that's, I think it's used as rock. So the basalt is still used as some stone, which is good. Um, and we can take a look here. Our worth, 
The worth for the dormitory? It's worth 16. Our uh, stockpile, I don't think, is necessarily worth anything. And can we actually, I'm curious, designate area, grove, personal quarters, dormitory, dining room, guard. Nope, nothing yet. So we don't have to worry about that quite yet. Um, these guys are still kind of, we'll actually speed up time a little bit while they do that. And once we have a, a solid, decent area cleared of the trees, well, I would like them all to clear, be cleared up, but I just want them to finish. Once they're clearing, I think the these guys can, the woodcarvers are actually going to be able to start building stuff too. But for now, they are going to be just kind of clearing all the wood. I wish the, the logs would stack. I really do. I understand that it's kind of hard for them to do that, but uh, just because it's so many. But I wish they would. Um... Do I want to mine some more area? We probably should. Let's mine... Mine... A wall. And we'll just start clearing... Out... Some more area. Get the miners doing that. Look at that, they even have a dormitory to sleep on and everything. It's great! It's so great! Mmm! Makes me so happy. Good stuff. And they can start continuing their mining, which is gonna be great. Um, once these trees are felled, man, these guys need to get get to it. I mean, I understand they want to do their thing. Oh, one of the, I think one of, oh yeah, this person right here. Let's take a look at their names. Let's take a look who we have. I haven't taken a look. We've got Nabro, Hedera, Ozzles, Woodledan, Woodledan, Waddle, Wobble Dan, Wobble Dan, Pine Spink, Pindle Gen Gondol, Fizzle Dan Kindle, Walco, and Dimble Togla. Yep, those are names. Those are gnome names for sure. Great. All right. Well, these people are sleeping. That's unfortunate. We still got one who's hard at work. Who? Oh, never mind. Not anymore. It looks like a. Uh, what's his name? This is uh, Wobble Dan. Wobble Dan got a little bored. And what? Oh, she's the only one without a bed, which is, which is really unfortunate. We're gonna rotate a little bit, and we're gonna have the. We're gonna have a build order for another bed. Um, another straw bed for when we can. Uh, I just want it there. So just that way, when we have the straw. They'll be able to build the bed, so... I'm gonna actually... Do I like this angle a little bit better? I don't think so. We'll do it like this. It's fine. I'm not really worried about it too much. Just waiting for time to kind of fast forward a little bit so they can continue doing their jobs. Everybody needs to start waking up! Guys, it's almost noon! Wake up! It's noon time! Holy crap, these people are just sleeping away. They're like me when I have a abnormal sleep schedule. Let's go. Anytime. I would like you guys to wake up at any given time. Well, I mean, we could use these as, as we could use this as time to give orders. But right now, the orders that I have is to build stuff that they haven't been able to build yet because they're too busy doing this. Um, I guess what we could do is designate an area as a pasture. Uh, but I want the trees gone first before I, I kind of get the solid idea of where I want it. Because I might want to do like the pasture here, or uh, what is she doing? Why is this? Oh, she's just chopping down the tree over there. Alright. So they're going to continue stacking away. Looks like uh, they're actually getting some decent mining done now. The basalt's nice and quick. Everybody else is moving stuff. So everybody's working as a team. And we're going to keep designating this area as stockpile. Uh, right up to here. Once it's all said and done, there we go. Soil, stone, and wood. Done. And now they have plenty of places to move and stock stuff. And Woodle Dan is still sleeping, but he was up late chopping trees, and you know, you can't really blame him for doing that. I understand. I would be too if I were him. Um, so we don't have to worry about him too much right now. Oh, he's up. He's actually out and about doing some stuff. And it's already almost nighttime. These gnomes are going to become nocturnal because of how long they slept. But whatever. It's their own decision, not mine. Let's designate an area now for a pasture. Could probably do it to about... Once this tree is down, we could do it to about here. That'll be the pasture right outside. So, um, max males, max females. I don't know. I, oh, is our yaks completely gone? Are they are they literally gone now? I hope not. Like, we waited a day and they just wandered off. Oh, that's obnoxious. I hope not, but we'll see. If that's the case. That'll be really bad. Um, we'll actually build, a, we'll designate an area as farm as well, right out here. A small area, of course. Just a 3x3, three three, just like we had last time. And it will be for strawberries. And we'll have another one for wheat. Perfect. Done. Now we have farms and pastures right outside of our mountainous, rent, oh, our mountainous home. We're also filling up very quickly with logs. And I know we'll run out of room really quickly. But our farmers have something to do now, which is excellent. Um, and I hope we get to see our yaks. I mean, our ranchers 
Where's our ranchers? Let's see what the what are the ranchers up to? Um, rancher, or one rancher, move to. Where is he? He's up here. They have to be gone. They have to be. There's no other. I can't even imagine that they're still around. They're gone. There's nothing I can do. So once our woodcutters are done chopping down wood, hopefully they'll start building stuff. I hope that's the case. So we can start building more useful things. Um, do we have any wheat at all? Can they plant wheat? Oh, we must have wheat seeds then. That must be what they're planting. So we'll have a nice nine little plot of land of, uh, for wheat. And uh, I'm curious. I kind of want to build uh, terrain. I kind of want to build walls. Um, a log wall. Just to kind of make sure that we're going to be safe. So we should... Oh, there's our yaks! There he is! Get him! Go get him! Shit! Alright, let's terrain. Let's, um, we're going to fell some more trees here. Uh, right along here. Just that one tree, I guess. Because we're going to... I want to build... Uh... A wall. Log wall. Right along here. Uh, just to keep me safe, you know, from any monsters that may or may not show up. Though then again, they could probably just walk up the mountain. But it'll look cool, alright? It'll look awesome. And let's just cancel one order for the door. There we go. And it'll get them to get them to use a little bit of the rocks. And we'll also build furniture, workshop, wood, uh, wood carving, which we need, what, we have a workbench, chisel. Oh, we need to build a chisel on one of these. Crude workbench, chisel. Um, requires masonry one, huh? Craft a chisel, please. Please build a chisel. That would be great if you could. Requires masonry one. Wait. Task craft item. Move to. Uh, crude workbench, chisel. Uh... Chisel. What does it require? Overview. I'm hoping that they'll be able to... Cru uh, we'll do chisel. Requires raw stone. Raw stone found naturally. Two of them. And we want to craft a two. We want to make sure we always have two, I think, is what we want. So I'm hoping that'll, that'll actually happen, because we have this workbench, which is a chair. I want to make sure we always craft to one. Did it work? No. Is it not saving? Craft chair. Right? Craft up to... One. Repeat. Craft to one. Only crafts when the available amount is less than the specified amount. Okay. Is it not working? I feel like it's not working. So that was crafted to two. Chair's actually there. Chisel's there. Okay, let's see if this actually works. Um, crude workbench. Let's get a workbench. Craft up to one. Craft to one. Let's hope this works. Once they all wake up, we'll know for sure, but I'm hoping it, it works. We have one person who's probably sleeping out in the wilds of the forest somewhere. That's fine. And we have this huge stockpile area, which I'm hoping eventually gets fixed. Is she gonna work? Oh, oh, what are we, what is she, cr oh god, are we actually gonna get something? Oh, the, she, he's actually taking it for the chisel. Oh my goodness. And he's gonna craft a chisel. Yes. Yes. Oh, he's working hard. Who is this? Nabro. Nabro is working on making a crude chisel here. And he made it! Oh, wow. And he's gonna make another one, too. So let's get furniture. We need a workshop. We need a uh, wood carver because I'm not quite sure. There was something I wanted to build. I forget what it was. Um, build terrain, floors, storage. I can't craft storage crates or barrels without a carpenter's workshop, which we desperately need. But it looks like they're not building. What does it require? It requires log, which we have. Okay, maybe we have one somewhere. Let's uh, build a workshop, workbench, carpenting workbench, which we have none of. What about the workbench? Make this a priority. Move up. Okay, make that workbench, please. 
I don't know why these people aren't making what I want. Let's see. Is it just a profession thing? Builder? We have a builder, though. Uh, woodcutter. We have a woodcutter. Um, it ain't blacksmith, miner. I don't know what it could be. Maybe you guys will know. You have to let me know if there's something I'm doing wrong. But I'm gonna put this. I'm gonna put this here anyway. Uh, a carpenter area. Just gonna do a little rotating here. Whoops. Uh, on the off chance this actually works. So let's see if it actually works. I doubt it will. Um, I'm not quite sure why it's taking them so long, but I'm gonna, if you guys don't know why, please let me, if you, rather, if you know why, please let me know why. That would be awesome. Um, why? Oh, yak. There we go. That's why it wasn't working. Cool. Alright, so if you guys know why, please, please, please tell me why. Um, I'm not quite sure why they're not building. So, thank you guys so much. We definitely made some progress here, some solid progress, and I will see you guys next time.